People with blood group O can donate blood to all other blood groups. Particularly, there are no elements that can damage blood from another person in erythrocytes of blood group O. They can thus donate blood to all other groups while solely receiving blood of their blood type. They are quite unique as a result. The generations that came before us, that paved the road for us had O-type blood. Whatever nature had in store for them, they managed to survive. As a result, the blood type became a mark and a symbol of leadership abilities. Even today, it is believed that people with this specific blood type are more productive than the ordinary person. It is not surprising that some adverse outside influences can be harmful to the health of those with type O blood. They are prone to conditions like thyroid problems, diabetes, and morbid obesity. The causes of the above-mentioned problems could include stress, problems with anger, being overworked, and many other things. One of the main problems that might seriously endanger these people's health that is brought on by the same causes is insulin resistance. When you have the O type of blood, health issues including stomach ulcers and iodine shortage are also not too far away. Additionally, these hormonal abnormalities might result in serious issues like tumors, which are painful and inflammatory. O type blood does in general come with a fair bit of warning. Why is it so special? Knowing your blood type is a good thing. Japanese people frequently inquire about someone's blood type or attempt to determine someone's blood type based on their personality, because they believe that each blood type has a distinct personality and affinity. This particular blood type is linked to exceptional traits like leadership, devotion, responsibility, organization, etc. It is a widely held opinion that those with O-type blood are better at creating thorough plans, sticking to them, and completing the work. They are perceptive, comprehend their environment and surroundings better than other individuals, and ensure that they act in accordance with this understanding to avoid problems and setbacks. They are better able to assess the situation at hand. O-type blood has its own problems as was already mentioned. People with this blood type are more likely to develop heart conditions and experience other hormonal problems. They are susceptible to a wide range of disorders, from thyroid to more acidic stomach. They occasionally succumb to iodine deficiency as well, which can result in a variety of stomach problems from rashes to ulcers. It is rather safe to assume that stress may be the root cause of all the above problems. Anger is a common source of stress. People with O-type blood have weak impulse control and a variety of psychological tendencies. This very naturally causes a lot of additional issues like taking unneeded risks, which in turn causes hazardous behaviors like gambling and risky pastimes. These people would only need to stay healthy by abstaining from caffeine and alcohol, both of which alter the levels of adrenaline in our body. As a precaution, leading a sedentary lifestyle is not particularly recommended. People with O-type blood can live healthy, happy lives with a good routine, some moderate exercise, and a balanced diet. As long as they understand their health and give it some thought before acting rashly, everyone with O-type is genetically privileged to be one step ahead of their counterparts, in practically every conceivable sector. This blood type was present in our ancestors, who used their intelligence to pave the road for us, which suffices as evidence that the benefits of having this particular blood type outweigh the drawbacks. Thank you for watching and please subscribe for our next video.